surprise everyone. We're going to the airport. Just got my lift. They're calling right now. Current time, 5.50 in the morning here. Flight takes off at 7.25. I have a 7 a.m. boarding. Yes. How's it going? Go. I'm actually like wide awake. <laughs> <laughs> So You're much. Welcome. Enjoy your flight. Fly safely. Yes, sir. Ugh. Thanks again, my friend. Thank you. Thank you. Bye bye. See ya. We've got a lovely uh, half an hour, 25 minutes until boarding. Cutting it close here. I feel like I'm becoming a pro traveler. I am though extremely, extremely tired. I woke up like just ready to go. However, now I'm just like hitting a wall. Hmm. Regular TSA's. Seven to 11 minutes, we're good to go. Made it through with a breeze. Real quick, let me, let me show you my fit check. Got uh, my super dry on and Comfy, comfy pants. We're going to Wisconsin where it's 30 degrees. 30 degrees out. Also, we're flying Southwest. I don't think I told you guys that. I don't know, I, I'm half asleep. This brain is up, this side of my brain is dead. Make the smart choice, everybody. <sighs> smart water. I feel I've completely mastered coming to the airport with as little time as possible. I feel like we can still adjust it a little bit because we have about 20, 20 minutes until boarding. Also, my sister has no idea that I'm coming home, so I'm surprising her today. Somehow, some way, we'll figure out a way. Does anybody else just go to their gate and just look and like, yep, everything's good. Me every time. Okay, now here's the thing. I booked this just randomly because I haven't seen my family in forever and I thought it would be fun to kind of experience fall in October when I where I grew up and I haven't really felt a real fall in like four years. So yeah, I'll just go back to Wisconsin, hang for a little bit, see what there's to do, bring a lot of you guys there because a lot of you guys haven't been there since the last time I was there. So uh, we're gonna go back home. And it's boarding time now, so let's go. Thank you. We got a full flight. If you can help us out, once you step on board, step out of the aisle as quickly as you can, full flight. Allow the person behind you to find those seats as well. We should be pushing this airplane in about 17 minutes. <laughs> I'm just gonna go all the way to the back. Also, I feel like Southwest got some new seats here. See this? Usually they're all blue, so I wonder if these are gonna be more comfortable. But time will tell. Time will tell. But I kind of like getting on early. I was born in group A53, and I like going all the way to the back. Hopefully, we just don't have kids, but I uh, have grown to learn. Going to Milwaukee, there's always going to be kids, so I am think I'm pretty good with it. It's freezing on this aircraft. They go, yeah, we'll get, we're getting you ready for Wisconsin. Thanks, Southwest. It's actually really cold. I think it's like 60 degrees on this flight. Next stop. Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Dad's picking me up.
Oh, I can feel the brisk air already. Can't wait to go outside and smell that. Haven't smelled that in years. We haven't been home for like three to four months though, so it's gonna be back here in Wisconsin like always. Oh yeah, you know you we're home when we see this. Go pack go, baby. We'll be here for the game. Still undecided if we're gonna be going Sunday, but it's probably like a thousand dollars, so I'm kind of leaning towards not going to the game. Now, growing up here in Wisconsin, I didn't think that we actually had an accent, but coming back here and just listening to people talk, I can totally hear a Wisconsin accent in other people. Comment down below if you guys can hear it when I talk, but I don't feel like I have much of a Wisconsin accent anymore, as much as like my family and obviously people who live here in Wisconsin. Could I have a grande pumpkin cream cold brew? I forgot. We're now in a cold state, and I ordered an iced coffee. Good job, Kyle. I swear this tastes so much better when you're in a state that actually has seasons. Ooh, it's so good to be back home. And I need to put on a jacket. I haven't done this since, ooh, months. That feels strange. My dad's a little late. Also, does anybody's parents, look at my dad's text messages. He always says, bye bye, bye bye, <laughs> bye bye. About to feel 40 degree weather. Whew, that is nice. That cold, brisk air, baby. We're back home. Sure is cold, though. Oh my gosh, it goes right through this this shirt and these these pants. Hey, you here? Come down to the four. I'm all the way down here. All the way down. All the way down. Okay, bye. Bye. Bye, bye. Woo! I am actually shivering now. It is getting serious. I don't know my dad is supposed to be coming down here. Yeah, I think I'm by the baggage, but... Okay, I'll be right here. I gotta go around. You can go. Should I stay here? Nothing compares, though, to last year when we were at the Green Bay Packer game when it was like four degrees out, but definitely acclimated to Florida, so this is just... It's great, <laughs> but it's, it's cold for sure. And it's supposed to get to 30 degrees. It's like 40 right now. I'm such a baby now. I'm so disappointed in myself. You love my Florida heat. Still waiting for my dad. Still waiting for that guy. Good old clown. I think this is him. Here he comes, taxi. Oh, this car just cut him off. <laughs> Yo. Yo. Hi, Dad. Hello, I'm the Uber. Come on in. What's it's, your name? It's cold. It's really cold. So your car smells like gas. Oh, I slammed that hard. My bad. How you turn that off? Okay, cool. Hello, Dad. Hello, welcome to Wisconsin. Ooh, it's so cold. Surprise. Because yes. I didn't even I didn't tell anybody. No, I I just got the word and I go, oh my goodness, it's a surprise visit. And he found out yesterday. Alexa has no idea. I mean you guys have nope. no idea. Nope. Nope. Come Total on. surprise. Roll, Wonderful. Roll up the window is kind of hot. I mean, hot. It's cold. I'll put the heat on. I feel how cold my hands are, for real. All right. Welcome to Wisconsin, everybody. Uh, my sister right now is working out, um, so we'll probably surprise her coming up soon. My mom knows. You guys don't know. Okay, we're home. I love coming home because it's like a nice, like reset button. I was thinking when I was in um, the airport the whole time, while you're like when I was getting coffee and you're driving, I was like, "This is great, it's so good! I can't wait to go home and smell in the backyard and see Rocco." Are you working today? Yes. We're coming at a perfect time too, because as we're going, look at the leaves; they're turning. It's fall, baby. It's fall. The snow is. Heck no, I'm leaving. Oh, by the way, I don't know when I'm leaving. I didn't book a return flight, do you know that? Oh, okay. I don't, I don't know when I'm going. Oh. First, when I 
uh, leave Wisconsin, graduate college, they start to redo these roads. It used to only be two lane roads and it used to take forever, but now they're like expanding it for I think three or four on each side from Sogville basically to downtown Milwaukee. There's your concrete update for the day. <laughs> There's my first job. McDonald's, right there. Do you remember that? I absolutely hated that job. It's a good first job, I'll tell you that. Look at those pretty trees. Oh my goodness. But one of my favorite parts, besides seeing my family, is seeing Rocco. I love it. <laughs> Nothing like coming home and having a dog excited for you. He's gonna get excited. I'm gonna go over there by the uh, tree. Okay, so just let him come out? Yeah, I'm gonna let him come out. Either you're gonna be over here to watch him. All right, he's... Oh, <gasps> it's chilly. All right, dad's gonna let Rocco out. He's gonna come run into me. Rocco. Who am I? Oh, hi, baby. Hi, baby. What's up, baby? Oh, hello. Hello, come here. You excited? Hello. You're not as excited as I thought you'd be. What are you doing? Oh, good to see ya. Rocco, I'm, I'm home. Does not care. Rocco, come back. Rocco. <laughs> he does not care. Dad. I am, he's ignoring me. <laughs> he's ignor he didn't even say hi once. No, he will. <laughs> Look at he's coming. Because <laughs> you called him. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna go inside and see if he's happy inside. <laughs> what a letdown. I guess uh, going pee is more important than saying hi to me. You haven't seen me in like four months. Let's see how he is inside. Ah, oh, there's the excitement. Is it because you were outside? Huh? Huh? Little baby, you smell like dog. Yes, you do. Thank you. See, now he's looking for treats. I go. No. All gone. Dad, you're eating. All gone. Hello. Don't burp Don't burp Well, Rocco, I thought that was going to be a little bit better. Now, for my sister, I think my mom's going to text Alexa that she left the, the crate. What, what do you call it? The, the fence mm -hmm. down? Is that what you call it? And she's going to say, go check on Rocco because he might be roaming around the house. And what? I'll be here roaming around the, the house. Dog the dog fence was down, but it's not. Just to get her to here, come here and make sure Rocco is a-okay. Right? Right? <laughs> Did you hear me? Did you hear me trying to get him? Call mom and be like, there's somebody in your backyard. She called me so late. She was supposed to give me like a 20 minute warning. Rocco, come here. <laughs> My mom is so bad at telling me information. <laughs> Surprise. I thought there was somebody in their backyard and I was like, I'm not going in the house when there's somebody creeping in the backyard. <laughs> Dude, he was wandering off, not paying any attention. <laughs> She calls me. She should be there any second. Well, I'm in the freaking backyard. You didn't know it was me? Well, I saw a man and I was like, what is that? I was like, it kind of looks like Kyle. You're lucky because I just checked uh, my friend's location on Oh, Find snap. My... Oh, wait, I'm on Find My Your Friends? Yeah. Am I really? Yeah. I didn't know that. <laughs> Surprise! I just told mom, I was like, if I have to clean up anything from Rocco roaming the house, she owes me. You're off today, right? Yeah. Nice. I don't have a return flight either. You said you weren't coming home. Yeah, you know, I lied. Was, I told, we, were, we were surprising you. I told grandma that you weren't coming home either because she told me on the video. If she watched the video, you were coming home. That's when funny. When did you get home? I think an hour ago. Rocco, I thought you were going to be roaming the house when I walked in. <laughs> roaming the backyard. <laughs> it would have been better if you didn't see me and you just saw him prancing out there. I was about to go in the backyard because I saw a man, so I was about to creep and be like, what is going on? <laughs> but I was going to actually walk in the house filming to see if Rocco was out to see if he was, like, 
sitting right here. Yep. I get out of the car and I see Rocco roaming the neighbor's yard. Oh god. Yeah. Yeah. So tell him that. I sent him a text now. He's right here. Yeah, it was six minutes in advance. I didn't see it. <laughs> Bye -bye. Okay, come here, I have a gift for you. Don't look. It's just gonna be the hat that I asked you to get. I have a gift. Yeah. Whoa, <laughs> I wasn't expecting this. Why do you want that? Thank you. For my Halloween costume. Oh. Cool. Well, I also do have two gifts for mom and dad. Right there. They'll open that a little bit later. Wow, a mug? I think these are so cool. Like, look at this. Chip? Yep, yep, hold on. I don't know, I think these are still for sale. And look at this one. Is it Dale? Oh, those are cute. But look. <gasps> Whoa. Isn't that cool? That is cool. They're like 12 bucks. Hi guys. <laughs> I'm told that I have to talk to you. Actually right now I am currently checking in for my vacation coming up very, very soon. Did you tell them? Um, some people know. Well, say it for tomorrow. I won't be in the video tomorrow. Okay, tell them now. Okay, I'll tell you now. I. I will be coming um, next Saturday, October 22nd whoop, whoop. Whoop, whoop. Um, for a few days. I'll be coming with some friends and stay tuned to what we're going to be doing because it's going to be lots of fun. No dad, no mom, but some cool friends. I forgot to pack shorts. <laughs> see you in tomorrow's video. Yep. See you tonight though. Or soon. For real guys though, I did forget to bring shorts. I just brought these and jeans, but like you may be asking why do I need shorts in Wisconsin when it's 40 to 30 degrees out? I don't really wanna wear pants inside the house cause it gets really hot. I don't know. I How did I forget shorts? I told my sister to come over cause I have a surprise and this is my surprise. A few of you guys might know what this is. I just set up my Xbox 360 from back in the day literally the greatest thing ever with my old scuff controller this is priceless gonna play some good old call of duty ghosts let's play some multiplayer and if you guys don't know i'm kind of a big gamer so this is pretty much all i did growing up play games there is a hundred and nineteen players online that is insane the input lag is so bad and for those of you who don't know what input lag is it's just basically when you go right it takes forever to go right there's like a delay not ideal when you play video games. Do you want to play some games? No, I don't want to play Xbox. 360. Oh, sorry. Do you have a monitor, though? No. It's too leggy. This should be my thumbnail. <laughs> what is it, Doc? What's the verdict? First of all, you should know that I can't hear anything when you're talking and moving <laughs> around. And it's fine. It's fine. 118 over 82. Mm. Our mother just got home. I have to show you your gifts. What? It's under here, okay? Oh, okay. Three, two, one. Aww, it's so cute. They're mugs. That is, oh, that is really cute. <laughs> I have another coffee mug. We have a, we have a, we have a, we have a, we have a his and hers. No, it's called Chip Actually, and Dale. Yeah, that's his okay, and Okay, Chip and Dale, <laughs> but his and hers also. Actually. All right, everybody, that is going to be it for your guys' daily dose. Wanted to see if we get my mom in here, and uh, we're going to pick it up, actually, right from here for tomorrow's vlog. So, yeah, good to see you, Mom. Welcome home. Lex and I are off to go do some fun activities. That's tomorrow's vlog. Okay, bye.